Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven, and in today's video, I want to introduce you to the functionality that we have in Microsoft Loop, where you can save your pages, loop pages, as templates for others to use. Um, in one of my earlier, you know, videos, I actually you know recorded a video and explained the uh, concept of a uh, you know template a gallery that we have in Microsoft Loop, and this is where you can pick one of the uh, kind of existing, uh, you know, templates uh, from Microsoft, uh, for, you know, to create loop pages. But, you know, let's just say you created one that you really love and you want uh, everyone else to use it and reuse it, uh, right? You want to kind of standardize um, uh, on the look and feel, uh, for example. So here I have uh, this uh, employee onboarding, uh, you know, loop page with, you know, different uh, text and, you know, tasks uh, related to onboarding. And you know what? I want everyone to reuse it. All right. Uh, this page has been built. I want everyone to reuse it. Here's what you need to do. Uh, very, very easy to do. So uh, you go to the three dots next to that page and you choose save page as template. And essentially now you can uh, give it a name. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to uh, change this slightly because, right, we don't want the name to be part of the template. And then, uh, yeah, I'm going to do the same here as well. All right, you know, this is our name of that template. And that's it, you just uh, save uh, it as a template. Uh, it actually, I don't know if you noticed, but um, uh, you know, as I was saving it, it actually said where that page will be saved to. It will be saved to the template gallery. Let me show you now how uh, we can reuse it. So now I'm going to be clicking, uh, you know, the plus sign, right, at a new page. And obviously, instead of you know starting from scratch, we're going to use one uh, based on the template from the template gallery. And of course, by default, you're going to see the the template gallery I mentioned earlier, right? These are the all the different Microsoft you know templates that you can use and reuse. But you know, and these templates, by the way, you cannot like uh, you know really uh, delete or anything like that. But here we have you know templates uh, that are available you know for uh, essentially for everyone to use right here. And um, yeah, I can just literally select one and I can use this template and uh, look at this. Essentially, my page will be uh, built uh, based on that uh, template. It actually took a few seconds for right, to render it. I, you know, on the screen, I had to refresh the page, but you know, here it is. Here is my new, you know, um, page that created and, uh, you know, I can uh, uh, actually now customize it further, but, uh, you know, all the content has been uh, essentially populated on this page uh, based on this uh, particular template. Now, another thing uh, I want to uh, explain that's uh, something that's actually really important. Uh, you can only reuse the page, you know, loop page templates within the same workspace where they were created from. So I'm still within this HR workspace and, you know, let me create another page and I'm going to pick on, uh, you know, the template gallery. Uh, look, it obviously gives me Microsoft templates and then, uh, you know, uh, it gives me uh, those uh, loop uh, page, you know, templates that I created. But... You know, it even tells me over here, this template belongs to this workspace. So what does it mean? It means that let me go to another, I'm in another workspace over here. This is a website redesign workspace. I'm going to uh, be pretty much repeating the, the same thing. Let me actually delete those few blank pages I have. And then, uh, let, yeah, let's create a brand new one. Again, I'm repeating the steps. Look at this. The you know, template gallery does not show me any templates. Why? Because that other template was created in that workspace uh, and I don't have any custom templates at this workspace. So that uh, workspace specific, all right? Very, very uh, important to understand that. All right. Um, what else? Uh, I think if you want to delete it, uh, let me show you how to do that. Uh, you kind of need to go back to, um, you know, to the template gallery 
And if I want to delete this, um, you can rename it. But if you, I don't want this at all, you see I just deleted it. Very, very easy, uh, you know, to do. So really nothing complicated uh, here. But in my opinion, right, I mean, if you maybe have an, a workspace, in a, you know, for, let's say, your department, you know, your HR or, you know, projects, whatever it is, I mean, those templates we will be created. And just remember, you can only reuse them in that particular workspace. All right, so hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Goodbye.